What's up Mopar fam? I hope everybody out there is having a fantastic time. So today's video, I just kind of wanted to give you an update on what's been going on with Frostbite and myself and uh, what's new and what's coming up. So start with, I know I haven't put up anything this week. Uh, things have been pretty slow and I'm dying to get Frostbite to the track. As you can see, she's been on the trailer for over a week now. Um, the last couple weeks, the track has been rained out. This past Friday and the Friday before that, it got rained out, so we was not able to go run the truck with the new stall converter in it. Um, so that has been killing me, guys, not to get the truck on the track after the new stall converter. Hopefully, fingers crossed, guys, hopefully this Friday we should be able to run the truck. It's looking like the weather's gonna be good so far. So fingers crossed we don't get rained out again and we can finally get the truck to the track and find out what it's gonna do with the new edge stall converter. Um, some other things that, you know, that we've been doing is my trailer, actually just finished with that. I lengthened my trailer about five feet so that we can fit the new golf cart on the trailer. And, uh, you know, also we got the, the exhaust stacks on Frostbite Hauler which I haven't put a video up on what it actually sounds like yet. So that's what we're going to do today. We're going to check out the cool new sound on the Frostbite hauler. We're going to go down the uh, we're going to go down the road, do some flybys with the whole race set up. So that way you guys can see what those exhaust stacks sound like. I love exhaust stacks on a diesel. Some people hate them, whatever, but it's what I like and I think they sound absolutely badass. So, especially with the load on, it's gonna sound awesome. So you guys, stay tuned. We're about to go down the street and get some footage of the Frostbite hauler in action, towing the race setup. So, yeah guys, um, other than that, we've just been pretty much trying to get stuff ready to go to the track. You know, like I said, we've been working on the trailer, we've been working on the truck, we've been working on the golf cart. Um, so it's just been, you know, been doing what I can to stay busy, upgrade things, you know, for the racetrack. Hopefully we don't get rained out and we can actually go get some new times on the truck. I'm, I'm absolutely dying to see what we're going to run with the stall converter. Now, with that said, I have some huge, huge news coming up very, very soon. So as most of you guys know, we put the stall converter in my stock 545 RFE transmission. Now, as of right now, that transmission still bone stock besides the Transgo shift kit and J Green's tuning. So it has the stall converter in it, the shift kit, and tuning. So far, the transmission has been holding up. I haven't had an issue with it. It's still going strong. And I think we'll still be good for, you know, probably a handful or a dozen more passes down the drag strip I think with no problem but with that said that transmission will not be in that truck much longer we are going to upgrade that transmission and it is going to be absolutely massive upgrade it is no longer going to be a 545 um, I will go ahead and let you in on a secret though it's not going to be an 8 speed either but it will be a Mopar transmission and it's going to be absolutely bad ass um, this transmission is no joke and I can't wait to do some video footage on it and get some track runs when we get it all done but let's just say this winter frostbite will be going under massive massive surgery for some serious racing upgrades this truck will be on a complete new level it's not even gonna, I mean it's, it's gonna go way above this truck is gonna be stupid nasty and that's all I can say so Stay tuned, let's go down the street, listen to Frostbite holler, and do some cool shit. All right guys, we're gonna do a cold start real quick of the Frostbite holler, so here we go. I told you 
that thing sounds absolutely awesome. So let's go for a ride, see what it sounds like going down the road with, I don't know, 8,000 pounds probably behind it. So let's go for a ride. The cell phone is going to pick it up right now, but we'll go down the street, go through some gears. there you go frostbite hauler with the new exhaust stacks on sounds pretty sick i'm sure you guys like it hopefully this friday we don't get rained out again guys and we can go run frostbite and see what she'll do with the stall converter in so fingers crossed that we can get to the track friday but i think that's going to do it for the video today guys as always stay safe out there don't forget to hit that subscribe button tap the bell button for the notifications and we'll see you on the next one